this is Shadow Kirby 707, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last part, we got Epona back and heard some goats. And today we're gonna do some bunch of stuff, so let's talk to these kids and what they want. Oh, Shadow Kid, did you hear? They're selling the slingshot at the store right now. A slingshot! I wonder how powerful it is. I, I need it. I must try it. Talu, if you and Mala want it so badly, but just buy it at my parents' shop. Do you see any rupees in my hand? I can't afford that thing. Come on, Beth. Can't you just loan it to us for a while? You know I get in trouble for that. If you two want it, save up your allowances or something. But our allowances are terrible. Ah, uh, I wish I was born into a family with a slingshot instead of one with a water wheel. <laughs> Anyways, um, the girl's name is Beth. Um, that's Beth. And that little baby right there. <laughs> that baby looking kid is, um, Talo. And, no, Malo, Malo, Malo. And this guy's Talo. Duh. And of course there's Colin. What does he want? Hi, Shao Kei. You have the day off work today, right? So, I finished their fishing around I was making. Shao Kei, I figured I'd give it to you first thing in the morning, but my dad said you just wait until Shao Kei comes to, to, get, to get it. So, I didn't bring it to you. What a bummer. But, oh, see how much that slingshot is and hopefully buy it. All right, let's look around and see if we get any money. And what are you doing, dude? Well, hey, good morning, Shadow K. Got a day off from work today, boy. Not me, the wife's been ha hassling me. Today's the day to restock our store. Look, see, up there in that tree, if you see it, then use the analog stick, blah, 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 and get a better view. Yeah, some Ordon bees built themselves a fine nest up there, and I was thinking about knocking it down. Our cat hasn't come home since yesterday, so the wife's in a bad mood, at the very least. I need to bring something to her. Really? Well, let's check, um, his wife. And see what's wrong with her. Hello? What's wrong? Oh, uh... You okay? Oh my, it's young Shadow K. Welcome, M dear. You you didn't happen to see my little cat out there, didn't you? He ate the fish we were going to have for supper last night, and I gave him a good scolding, but then he went out and hasn't returned. I'm so fraught with worry for him. I've exhausted myself. Uh, but can I check the thing shop price? I'm terribly sorry, but my mind is so filled with thoughts of my little cat that I simply can't deal with customers right now. Well, if I had known this was going to happen, I would have let my little kitty eat fish to his heart content. Shao okay, I'm sorry, but would you believe me be? I'll serve you milk later. I didn't want milk, I just want a slingshot. <laughs> if to tell you the truth, guys, I hate milk. I cannot drink milk. I mean, I eat cereal, but I don't drink the milk at all. I just eat the cereal. It's disgusting for me. Try to talk. Oh, who is that? Say so Z target, then press A to talk to from people from in the distance. Hey, there you go. Over there. So listen, why don't you climb up to the vines? All right, so let's climb up these by yeah, vines and talk to this guy. Yo, there you are. Check this out. You know Sarah at the general store? Well, isn't that her cat over there? She's just sitting there next to the, my my house having a staring contest with the creek. You don't suppose he's thinking he's gonna catch a fish, do you? Ha ha ha. A cat. A cat can't. A cat can't catch. Man, ugh, tongue twister there. A cat can't catch. <laughs> wow. Anyway, that's not what. Uh, see that grass over there, the edge of the rock? How do I see you with that stuff? I figured it was pretty rare to see see it growing in a place like that, so I thought I'd let you know. Alright, and to um, jump, all you do is go into the ledge and just press forward. You don't press any button, you just press the analog stick to go forward, like in all Zelda games. Anyways, look at, the, at this um, little grass or whatever. And what is this? Oh yeah, I forgot. If if during a cutscene, sometimes it will let you skip the scene. Which you, you'll press the minus button. And I see something down there. I wanna take a look over there. I see something down there. I wanna see if, Oh, well, it's not far enough, so we'll take a little closer look. It's a monkey. But Hmm, I don't know what the monkey's doing there, but we'll just leave it alone for now. For now, let's just 
see what other people are doing. And there's Colin's mother, and oh, I'm um, good morning to you. If you're looking for my husband, he has a story left early this morning. But I must ask you, okay? You have not seen a cradle, so I'm floating by here. He yeah, a cradle. So she's missing a cradle, which I think is probably for you know her, her, her um, babies. So you know. Anyways, get more rupees, cause. We, never, we don't know how much the sink shot is, so it's best to get, you know, some rupees in case. And let's throw this one in. <laughs> Yo, don't waste food. Okay, I won't waste food. Nah, I will. I will waste the food to find the rupees. I'll do whatever I want. <laughs> they grow back anyway, so it's not like we're starving. As soon as you come outside and go in and out, the pumpkin's gonna grow back, so no need to worry. We're gonna live. We're not gonna die, people. <laughs> and of course, I'm getting rupees here, guys. And sorry, guys, it's kind of boring for the past couple videos, but... You know, it's just an intro. You gotta do a whole bunch of stuff. And there's her cat. And obviously, she's scared of us. And no, I'm not trying to hurt the cat. I'm just running <laughs> all right so she's uh looking for a cradle or she's missing a cradle so let's see if we can get a cradle for her and of course i'm looking for more rupees guys i'm sorry i mean there are there are more rupees than just one rupee there are fives and tens but they're like way up in the tree where the beehive is. Where, where the beehive is. Jeez, I cannot talk. But we'll get that later once we get the slingshot or whatever we can get to knock down that beehive up there. See, there's a beehive and there's vines and you can climb up to that. And there's some rupees up there, like fives and tens. But I don't want to get hurt by the bees, so. <laughs> and to tell you guys, I never got stung by a bee. And I, I know it hurts. Like, from a couple people, it hurts. I mean, for some people, it doesn't hurt. It's just a little pinch, but still, I would not... I, I hate... I would hate to get stung by a bee. Alright. Oh. You know, I should skip the scene. I, I honestly don't want to see that. Anyways, let's point our pointer to the monkey and see what the monkey has. Oh! Whoa! He, she's got a cradle! Well, we got the cradle from the monkey, or from the monkey. So let's. Oh my God! Did I seriously throw that? Oh my God! 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 Oh, my God. Oh, oh, okay, good, 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 good. At first, I thought I lost it. I'm like, oh my God! Oh my God! I can't. Uh, I never done this before. I never, I never, I never uh, swam with a cradle in the water before. I, I never done this. Oh my god. Uh, this, is gonna be, this is gonna be pretty difficult for me. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, Link. You can push the cradle. Come on. Can't you hold it with one of your hands? You're, you're strong. Come on. Oh my god. This never happened to me before. I never threw the cradle into the water. I never realized that. I thought you had to stall over again, you know. Do the monkey thing again. But I never realized that. Okay, come on, Link. Push it. Push the cradle. Really? Oh my god. This is really difficult. Okay, so far so good. I'm pushing it. Oh, come on, Link. Oh, uh, am I gonna spend the rest of the video doing this? Oh, jeez. Come on, Link. Oh, Link. Please push the cradle. Please. Ugh. He got two strong hands. You can use one of them to push the crate. Link, don't get up. Just go back in the water and push the cradle. And of course, we can't pick up the cradle if we're on land. I, I believe that. So we gotta push it. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Let's give it to her. Alright, I got the cradle for you. So... Oh, Shadow K, thank you. Did you go through trouble for me? Thank you. Oh, that reminds me. There was something I must give to you. All right, but I'm not going to wait for it. I'm just going to hurry to the house because it's much quicker. 
And there we go. I mean, I'm sorry that she's pregnant and she's slow, but I just want to get this fast enough. I'm supposed to give you this. All right, here you go. It is the fishing rod that Colin made for us. But we're going to test this fishing rod in the next episode. So next time we'll test out the fishing rod and hopefully get the um, slingshot. So this is Shadow Kirby 707 saying bye.